Hi, this is a short video just to quickly explain about the Kuma 4G Wi-Fi kit with Kuma antenna. This is the latest version of the Kuma 4G kit and I'm working from home here and just wanted to quickly show you what happens uh, when we use the kit at home. So I've got the kit set up in the window. The antenna comes with a small suction cup which I've screwed onto the back of the aerial, uh, the antenna, pops it in the window, and that's just connected to the router. SIM card goes in there, and I just wanted to also show you in this video the comparison between using a Kuma 4G kit and tethering uh, a standard smartphone. So I've got my wife's smartphone, which is on the 3 network, and I've taken the 3 SIM card out of my phone and I've put my three SIM card into the Kuma kit. Uh, we're quite semi-rural here, and three is the only provider that gives us any sort of signal whatsoever. Uh, so we're both on three, and um, I just want to basically show you how easy it is to just get a deal with anybody that provides a SIM card. Any SIM card in the world will work with a Kuma kit, completely unlocked to all networks. So if you're on a campsite or you live somewhere, that's only got one provider that will work, you can order up uh, a simple pay-as-you-go SIM card, pop that in and it will work and it will get you online um, for as long or as short as you want. And SIM deals at the moment are coming down and down in price. So we're online, we've got the three SIM card in the router and we've got the three SIM card in my wife's phone. And I'm gonna go to my computer now and I'm, gonna, I'm connected, as you can see, to her Samsung S10e. I'm just going to run a speed test on that. And uh, what the speed test does is it downloads a bit of data and measures the speed, and then it uploads the same data back and measures the speed of that as well. So you can compare the two systems. So this is connected to the phone, and uh, we'll see what happens then when we connect to the Kuma kit. As I say, a lot of people say, well, what's the point in buying a kit? I can just tether my phone. The point is, uh, in any scenario, you'll get a much, much better signal, uh, especially when you're on the edge of the signal and they've only got maybe one bar. The Kuma kit will push it up that two or three bars and it'll give you a much, much better signal, allow you to do all the things you want to do, like watch YouTube or Facebook or do emails, etc., etc. So that was the Samsung phone. I'll just switch networks now to the Kuma kit. Just connecting up now. Any device, by the way, can connect to a Kuma kit. It doesn't need to be a laptop. You can connect your mobile phones, tablets, smart TVs, Kindles, uh, Fire Sticks, Chromecast, anything can connect to a Kuma kit. So we're connected now to the kit. Let's rerun the speed test and get the results. So it's just connecting now. Again, it's exactly the same location. They're both in the window uh, for ease of comparison. And um, as you can see, the speed test coming through is uh, similar download speeds, well, vastly improved download speeds and uh, very much improved upload speeds. So your communication both ways is improved by using the Kuma kit. So that's it basically, a real world scenario. Uh, I'm at home in lockdown and the Kuma kit has proved itself to be invaluable in getting us a decent download. Thanks for watching.